Hey guys, good morning, afternoon. It's almost 1 p.m. I've been so busy this morning, so busy. I woke up, went straight away to finishing up invoices. I sent them all out last night for the Color Street orders and then I just had to like accept payments on some of them and check them off and I have kind of like a system of how I do it. So I was doing that this morning for like an hour and then I went straight into work mode. I started school today, which is insane um so i had to do like an orientation class so i did that that took me like an hour and a half and then i had to look over the actual course and start to like go through the syllabus and i need to order the book and just go through assignment due dates and things like that so it doesn't look like it's going to be too too bad of a schedule a lot of it is writing i'm taking nursing theories for five weeks and then I actually take like a few week break and then I start back again with research nursing research so not too too bad uh, it's mostly writing based which I would say I'm pretty good at so it's just time more time consuming than anything it's not like studying it's more like papers and things like that so we're gonna get through it one day at a time one assignment at a time so much on my plate right now I'm not exactly sure what I was thinking, but that's okay. I've never not been able to handle it before and we'll be fine. So I sat at the computer literally from the time I got up until, what time is it? 12.55 until about 12.15. And I was just like, okay, I'm done. I need to walk away. Uh, after I was done with my computer stuff, I went to go take a body shower because I am going to meet Bea at the gym uh, when she gets off tonight. So I just wanted to kind of freshen a little bit so I can put on fresh clothes and feel good good i don't know but Des asked me the same thing he's like why are you gonna take a shower if you're just gonna go work out i'm like i don't know don't don't question i'll take a shower again tonight so because i all need to wash my hair but my hair was still like okay i just wanted the ends are a little bit wet because i didn't wear a shower cap but i just mainly wanted to like do the rest of me just like i do pretty much every day but I guess I could have waited. Anyway, it doesn't matter. So while I was at the computer, I was doing orders. I edited and uploaded a Costco haul. So go check that out on my main channel. Um, I did my orders. I did school. I also had to figure out my student loans and like uh, attach them to work because my work does student loan uh, like por a portion reimbursement. So I had to do that. They do tuition reimbursement, which is awesome. So I had to do that it's just been a lot of like on the phone doing I had to set up Emmy's nine-year checkup uh, hers always falls in January I'm not sure why so I did that for her break next week I just had a bunch of stuff to do a bunch so now the majority of my color street orders have been paid for so I'm going to start packaging them up and getting um, shipping stuff put on them um, and figure out what my postage and stuff is because that's my next stop. I have like three or four people to meet up with today to give them their orders and then also I need to go to the post office and mail out orders. So I also need to come up with a meal plan and figure out what we're doing for dinner this week. We have plenty of groceries but I just need to figure out what exactly I'm doing for dinners. So that's what's on my agenda today busy busy definitely a lot of things to do and I've got a lot of it the majority of it done already so this is my next main priority is to get the majority of these packages out so that's what I'm going to do I will check back in when I'm done okay I'm starving I've got to take a little bit of a break I have most of them packaged up there I have maybe like 10 to 12 more so I'm going to go downstairs and like I said take a little bit it's dark i know sorry <laughs> there we go take a little bit of a break and try and just get some lunch sorry about that get some lunch and just watch a show relax for a minute my mind is spinning just attached it is just after two but i want to get stuff done before i have to leave and i want to meet bia at the gym tonight so, and I gotta figure out what's for dinner. Oh my gosh, it's never ending. Not having the greatest day. <laughs> and yes, I'm feeling sorry for myself because I broke my photo frame. I'm so bummed. It took me forever to find this and I didn't even find it. Nin ended up finding that one for me at another Walmart. And I opened it and it wasn't secure. Like the thing was broken. 
the back padding of it and it just dropped right out and shattered. I'm so sad because now I have to go look for another one. All right, I know I haven't vlogged very much today and I haven't showed you guys a whole lot, but this is my Hany Bunny's planner. I just got done updating it. The vlog is exporting, so I already got that done. Um, I am finishing up my planner for last week, but it's okay, I'm getting it done. The biggest part of the planner is not even writing the stuff down, it's putting the stickers. I put stickers and pictures and stuff all around it before I actually do anything. Like this is, a, for instance, I didn't do anything over the whole weekend, but I've already laid out some stickers and then I'll write around it. So my plan is to tonight after the girls go to bed before I lay down or take a shower and lay down, uh, finishing it up. So right now I ate lunch. I got to watch one show and I'm doing good. I'm going to come in here and finish a few more orders for about 20 minutes and then I'm going to leave and go run a couple of errands, pick up the girls. I'm going to take food with me for them which I think will work out perfectly instead of going out, getting them, and then coming back. Since I'm just meeting Bia at the gym, that'll allow me to pick them up at the very last minute. And yeah, I just think it'll work out the best. So I'm going to air fry some chicken nuggets. I have some carrots cut up, a few chips and apples cut up as well. And I'm gonna take them some juice pouches. And that's what they're doing for dinner because today, mama didn't have time to crock pot anything. I've been running, running, running in the house all day long. So it is what it is. Sometimes you just have to give a little better than picking up McDonald's because that's really what I want to do. I'm trying to be good and I'm trying to make stuff that I have at home. And it's freezing in this house, freezing. So I'm trying to move around. My watch is telling me like, get up and go. And I'm trying to, literally I'm editing the vlog and I'm like standing up moving like this in front of the computer because I'm like, okay, my watch is telling me to get up. <laughs> I gotta get up. Okay, I'm leaving the post office. Honestly, like, I'm looking forward to working out and getting out some frustration. I'm so irritated with the postal service in general, which I'm sure not, I'm not the only one, and I apologize if you work or your spouse works or anybody you know works for USPS because I'm not, I know they work very hard, but it's just... Ugh, I'm so irritated, so irritated at them, myself, I mean, all of the above. It's just like, I mailed out like my, I told you guys in the live that I had to switch up shipping a little bit because my last one that I, that I mailed out, I had had everything weighed and everything. They told me how much postage to put on, on them and like five people that actually received them had it they were sent back for not enough sufficient postage and i'm so irritated i'm like they were weighed they gave me how much to put on it like i don't understand why this was a problem and this was my last live like december whenever i had it 1920 and ridiculous that it took a month to get back to me i had to make it right with these people and like you guys that were stuck out like it just was a mess total mess and now randomly they come back a month later and on top of that the line was horrendous and the guy sees me walking in with my laundry basket and he's like ma'am I don't think you'll have time before we close to get those in and I'm thinking I'm in the door like why would you that's like telling yes it sucks but why that's like telling somebody that walks in five minutes before a restaurant's going to close sorry we already started closing down our kitchen we can't make food for you it doesn't work like that i was so appalled i was like okay i said that's fine i'll have my husband come tomorrow i beyond frustrated beyond frustrated the only thing i'm grateful for is that I had a big package and I they gave me a key like so I didn't actually have to stand in the atrociously long line <sighs> just so anyway I'm gonna take a chill pill calm down a little bit just kind of frustrated I'm gonna go get the girls and I have dinner for them that I told you I was gonna pack and I'm gonna meet me at the gym 
to get out some of this frustration because that's what it seems like I need to do. On a bright note though, I did lose weight today, which is great and I'm pretty excited and stoked about that considering I didn't feel like I had the greatest week. I mean, not I didn't cheat, but I did go to a couple places where I had to be very selective with my food, so I was pretty proud of myself that I ended up losing still like almost three pounds, which is awesome. So I'm gonna look on the bright side, try and stop being a negative Nancy, Go pick up my girls. We made it to the gym. Woo! There's a buttload of people here. You know what? It was even busier last Monday. Really? Yeah. Like, See, no people are already starting to die off. Thank God. Resolutions are already starting to go out the window. <laughs> but it's crazy. Like We couldn't even find treadmills together. We had to go do some stair climber thing that sucked. <laughs> and now we're doing treadmill, but I can't figure out how to do my watch. So it's like not doing anything. It says I've been working out. First. I thought I did. It says I've been working out for 22 minutes and it's been 40. So does it count if your watch is a track it? <laughs> like I feel like no, it doesn't. That could just be me. But I thought I was supposed to be smarter than this. No, stop judging your watch. <laughs> I can judge it when it was $400. You ready? Which blankie? Mini. Mini blankie? Yes. Lay down. Get in bed. Lay down. Mini blankie, which animal? Me, me, purple. Purple what? This purple. That purple mini? Yes. There you go. Now night. Mwah. Love you. Hello. What's wrong? The light. Mommy got it. Night night. It's okay. I love you. Dos abetas. I'll see you in the morning, okay? Night night. Okay, it's been a very long day. I'm exhausted. It is 9.30 and I have to go to work tomorrow, so it's time for bed. I'm gonna go to bed because I have done enough today. I packed up every single one of my orders. Oh, my foot is asleep. Every single one of my orders that has been paid for, they're downstairs ready to go because clearly the post office didn't wanna work with me today, but that's okay. And the vlog uploaded and I made a list of stuff that I still need to do tomorrow when I get off of work, but that's okay. Everything's gonna go. My foot is asleep and it's tingling. So I know today was kind of boring, sorry. It was just a lot of me, 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 me. I know that, I apologize. It's just one of those things that, it was just a day I had to get stuff done. Um, and pretty much from here on out, it's gonna be a lot of just getting stuff done because I dropped down back to one day a week at the hospital but I work many days at H&R. So for the next month, it's gonna be like tax season, tax, probably like six weeks, like big tax season time, but I still should have a vlog every day. So we'll see, Ho I'm hoping, fingers crossed. So I'm going to hit the sack, go to bed early. Hopefully you guys enjoyed today and we'll see you tomorrow, bye.